Here we're going in the greenhouse. Uh, we got quite a few plants started. Got the fan going on them. A little bit of a breeze from the fan makes the tomato plants a little stouter, makes them a little stronger. If you don't have air going on them, they get spindly, and this helps toughen them up. Here we have triple L tomatoes. These have a vine about 16 feet long on them and they're supposed to bear about two bushel of tomatoes. Here we have early Dutch cabbage. We're going to make some kraut this year, try to. And here we have Brussels sprouts. And there's some more triple L tomatoes. Here we have Karabis, early white. Karabis or something like a radish or a turnip except they're sweet they're not as bitter they don't have that bitter taste to them here we have some italian tomatoes and here we have ox hearts and mortgage lifters most of these are tomato seeds or seeds that my family have saved for over 40 years maybe longer than that. Here we have uh, ox heart tomatoes in six inch pots. Then we have more mortgage lifters in six inch pots. Over here behind the fan we have Cherokee purple tomatoes. Here we have super beef steak. Here we have Romo's. Here's red cherry tomatoes. Back here is more ox hearts. Down here we have some Romo's. They're like a, a tomato paste tomato. And down here we have some cucumbers. They're starting to come up. These are something like a burpee cucumber. Spring burpees is the name of them. And here's our thermostat on our heater. Whenever it gets below 60 degrees in the greenhouse, this heater kicks on. That's good because it doesn't run the electric bill up high. It just kicks on whenever it gets 60 degrees below that in here. You can see right now it's about 62 degrees. Now this is our greenhouse. We built this to do some chainsaw carving in in the winter time where we'd have a warm dry place. Plus you're able to see good with the clear plastic. And then we decided to raise some tomatoes. We put four befores in as our corner post. And then we put two by sixes, 12 foot long boards up along the sides to make the frame. And then we took four 16 foot cattle panels to put across the top. And we have a ridge pole going across the top. It is a two by six by 12. This will help support the greenhouse if we ever have a heavy snow. But uh, so far, so far the snow hasn't built up on this. It's melted away. So, I hope you like my little greenhouse. And the fan is to uh, blow on the plants to toughen them up. It makes them grow a little more stouter. If you don't have a fan on them, they'll just be spindly plants. Uh, I hope you liked it.